The other day, I got a phone call from my 19-month-old son. He'd accidentally hit the instant redial button on our home phone, and it called me back at the office. He didn't have an awful lot to say, but afterwards, I had a lot to think about. If an infant can ring up a five-minute toll call by accident, how can we be sure a two-year-old won't accidentally start World War III? Now, I know that seems extreme, and I admit I'm a warrior, so I hope you'll forgive me if I just get this latest doomsday scenario off my chest. We're on the verge of the end of the Cold War, and everybody's having a party in the Pentagon war room. While the sergeants are raising toasts, and the generals are phoning executive headhunters to get good positions in private industry, The three-year-old child of one of the guards, uh, children, of course, are invited to this party, wanders off while no one is looking, drops his little wad of Play-Doh on the ID security machine, which, of course, has never been field-tested for Play-Doh, and accidentally disables it. The kid wanders into the missile telemetry room, mistakes the framed picture of the B-2 bomber on the wall for a bat, gets scared, and lets go of his balloon. The helium in the balloon deactivates the sophisticated rare earth element gas fusion override and opens the missile control panel, arming the thermonuclear device. Now calm again, the child mistakes the beeping for his mother's microwave, pulls the bright yellow latch to see if the blueberry muffins inside are ready, and initiates the countdown. The only thing that can save the world now is his not turning the big, shiny key in its gleaming stainless steel armature. The child, an avid key collector, of course, gives the key a perfect three-quarter twist to the right, and boom. No more waiting for Godot. (sighs) Okay, I feel better now. It was only a fantasy. In fact, not a very good one. If there's one thing we can all be sure of, no one is going to be crazy enough to let a kid into the war room. Uh, Excuse me. Yeah, hello. No, no, this is not Senator Tower's office. Oh, hello, Mr. Vice President. Yes, I'm sure it happens all the time. You push the wrong button because it was nice and Big and red. Oh, great. Uh, listen, uh, uh, Danny, uh, yeah, no, listen very carefully. Where are you now? In the fun swivel seat with the big yellow handle. Okay, uh, Danny, don't touch anything. Now listen, listen very carefully. Where's your daddy? 